Welcome everyone to Giant Stadium in East Rutherford, New Jersey for this crucial Eastern Conference matchup of Major League Soccer. The United States national team, the man to watch in the back for DC United, probably their most consistent defender. Up top, Tony Miola, 1.33 goals against average. And in midfield, number 19, the breakaway. He pushes it on one side of Crosby. He goes the other. He has an open net, and it's saved. DC United chalked that one up to Steve Rammel. The linesman has a better angle on it. Man does the referee. The linesman says Viola did not get to the ball in time. Echeverry sends Rammel through. And let's watch the end result. Number 14, Steve Rammel runs onto it. Strikes it first time. Does it elude Tony Miola? Does the entire ball get over the goal line? Of course it does. It's 1-0 in favor of the visiting D.C. United. That ball was clearly, clearly over the goal line. Miola did his best. But it slotted through his legs. And here's the ball going over. The entire ball going over the goal line. So a goal for Steve Rammel and D.C. United. And A.J. Wood scores. He's gotten the tying goal for the New York, New Jersey Metro Stars. A miscue by D.C. United goalkeeper Jeff Causey. Serena has been all over that man on occasion. The goalkeeper. I watched the end result of this play. The pass back to Jeff Causey. He misplays it terribly. And running on to it, it's number 22. A.J. Wood, and yes, someone for the Metro Stars has scored a goal other than Giovanni Savarese. Here's A.J. Wood, won't let the play die, knocks it in the opposite side netting for the equalizer for the home side Metro Stars. Good running onto the ball by A.J. Wood. He simply wouldn't let the play die, but Jeff Causey did indeed. Very, if he does it sooner, if he does it earlier, it's on. Echeverry to Tony Sene, he shoots, hit the header goes in the goal, and Echeverry is sending such beautiful balls in. He found number 20, Tony Sene, for DC United all evening long. Goes to show, receives it, curls it to number 20, Tony Sene, heads it in the opposite side netting past Tony Miola. DC United goes on top by a score of two to one. There's the goal scorer, number 20, Tony Sene. Sene with the, with the go-ahead goal in the 32nd minute of play where the New York, New Jersey Metro Stars trail DC United. Early, early on, the Metro Stars did well, but then DC United came on stronger. The thing to talk about is the corner kicks. They have seven corner kicks amounting out of 50. If they the Metro Stars, the Metro Stars in white will kick off, and it is. A good cross is kept in play. A.J. Wood is there. He scores. There's claims of a head ball. It will not count. It will not count. The referee ruling that A.J. Wood either used his hand to propel the ball into the net or, or fouled one of the D.C. United defenders in getting very nicely, very alertly. And Ramos keeps it clear. There's A.J. Wood at that near post. Metro Stars, there's over 25,000 people here at Giant Stadium. He matches up with Jeff Causey and Vermees shoots, and it's saved by Jeff Causey, who preserves it. Perhaps it'll come here. They've yet to score over 50 corner kicks, the Metro Stars. This ball, a long one into the box, cleared now by... Chalk this one up for Bruce Arena and DC United. It gives them a record of three and seven. We'll take a break here, just a moment. We're at Giant Stadium. We'll be back in just a moment to tap out the game.